हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अभी इंडिया आई एम गुरदीप सिंह सीनियर फैकल्टी अभिमन्यू वी हैव स्टार्टेड सीरीज ऑन डिस्प्यूटेड आइलैंड्स अर्लियर वी हैव कवर्ड थ्री डिस्प्यूटेड आइलैंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कवर स्कारब्रो शोल यू कैन वेल सी द लोकेशन ऑफ दैट शोल व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय शोल शोल मींस समथिंग और सम प्लेस or that platform which is related to corals whose origin is related to corals corals you must have read uh, in the books what are corals this is we are going to discuss scarborough shoals this is disputed island or disputed shoal it is disputed between china and philippines vietnam also claims it what is basically disputed disputed means that part of territory which is ya yeah, whose possession is disputed between two or more than two islands or locations means they are desired by two or three reason being why are, why is it disputed it is disputed due to presence of river or dispute due to mineral resources which every island or nation wants to possess ultimately the major cause of dispute these days is rivers water what is more important this is for fast degrading substance this is totally on the verge of depletion every every nation or every country wants to control the sources of water what is one of the biggest cause of dispute but there are many other causes like religious communism then mineral resources which every nation wants wants to occupy today we will discuss discuss scarpano you can just see the location this is adjacent to vietnam china and philippines this is basically a dispute between china and philippines <clears throat> no <clears throat> and presently which country possesses it it is china it is under the control of china china holds total control over this carbro shoal island and if we look at the history of uh, that uh, scarbro island in 1898 under the treaty of paris philippines was made colony of usa if philippines was made colony of usa it means that all parts of philippines all islands near to philippines were made colony of usa and this carbro it was returned to philippines in 1946 when philippines got independence since 1946 till 2012 it is under the possession of philippines philippines is using this island or shoal for military exercise between usa and philippines means usa does lot of military exercises on this shoal this island <clears throat> now and how after 2012 china got it from 1898 till 1946 it was under the possession of usa philippines was colony of usa from 1946 till 2012 it is under control of philippines from 2012 till today it is under control of china in 2012 china tried to occupy this shoal this island china got many army vessels around that island and 
totally blocked Philippines to enter this island, this shoal. If I am saying island, I, I, it means that I am talking about Scarborough Shoal. This island was totally blocked for the fishermen of Philippines. They were not allowed to enter or come near this shoal or island. What is the economic importance? Why does China want it? It is believed that this island, this shoal, is one of the richest sources of fishes, marine. It's rich in marine resources. It gives us fishes, lot of food which are rich in vitamins and proteins. So, China wants to occupy it. Secondly, it is under the Philippines economic, exclusive economic zone. Exclu uh, uh, from this exclusive economic zone, it is believed that Philippines uh, Philippines earned around hundred billion dollar uh, throughout its whole possession. This is so economically important. Next, <clears throat> why China wants it? Another reason is that China wants to have full control on the islands and on the waters of Southeast Asia. It wants to occupy East China. Here it is involved with Japan, South China. It is involved with uh, countries of Philippines. China wants to totally have, totally have full control on the waters of China Sea, whether it's South, whether it's East. Reason being, if it, if it is under the control of some other nation for example usa gets full control over this island through philippines it means usa is trying to come very closer to that china it simply china simply wants to evacuate usa from this oceanic waters china does not want full control of usa in these uh, in this uh, portion of continent reason being China and USA are totally hostile to each other their economies are totally different and China wants to keep USA away from this water secondly if you look at the location this island is at the end of sea East and South China Sea means the countries which control water or which control these islands will not allow neighboring countries to enter this water and it will stop all countries passing through this uh, uh, portion of the continent. What has China done to increase its presence? You can just see that China has built island around shoal. Building island around shoal. Just look at how its island built around shoal. Secondly, China has installed weapons. Thirdly, China is trying to command this portion through military ships, uh, then uh, through, set, uh, through positioning of their missiles, etc. China is building one of the biggest artificial islands, which is being criticized by all neighboring countries. Latest violations in 2012, China got military ships stationed there. It tried to block neighboring countries or islands to enter this uh, shoal. What is the Philippines reaction? Philippines in opposition to this China boycott all goods which are made in China. Vietnam did the same. USA also tried to boycott all the goods which are made in China. Means Vietnam USA, Philippines and all other Southeast Asian nations, they are trying to give a major dent on the economy of China. Because China is, everybody knows this is, this is manufacturing hub. If we stop buying goods from China, it will no doubt have some impact on the economy. What China did in reaction? China boycott all fruits which are imported from Philippines. China has put ban on the import of pineapples from Philippines. China 
also tried to deface the website of University of Philippines. It defaced, it hacked that website, defaced and put a banner saying Scarborough Shoal is in is part of China. What international law says? It says that China's possession over this Corbro island is illegal. Means it has ordered China to get this island. But China has completely said no to this. And what is finally going on there? Both China and Philippines are negotiating on a table. They are sitting, they are trying to avoid any sort of conflict because China also knows that if it violates major laws, then US will also interfere, which will create troubles. Because US is supporting Philippines and Philippines was once colony of USA. I hope you understood this disputed island. Next time we'll cover we will come out with another disputed island. Kindly share this video. Thanks.